So, uh, recently you finished up uh, Shania Twain's little tour. You were accompanying her, you were performing with her, you were looking for her. How was that? That was for the single best musical thing I ever got to be a part of. Yeah. I mean, I grew up listening to her stuff, so it's like, it's, you feel really lucky in life when you get to meet one of those people that you assume you'd never possibly cross paths with. Like, she was a superstar when I was a kid, um, so all of a sudden to pop up on stage. I found out a week before we were going on tour, they're like, hey, you want to sing party for two with her every night? And I was like, oh yeah. Um, it, was, it, was, it was really nerve-wracking leading up to it because you don't want to mess that up. Yeah. But it was just a tremendous amount of fun every night. Like, you get to play on sold-out arena stages. I don't yeah. know. I feel silly almost summarizing it because I could just tell you like a hundred times. It was great. Yeah. It was really great. It was so much fun. Is there and, anything like specifically that you learn like performing with her and like learning with her and you know? I mean? yeah, you know Probably the biggest thing, um, I've said this a couple times, but my dad called me in the middle of that tour, uh, or I called him or something, and I, I was nervous about whatever. Yeah. But, um, <laughs> and I remember him saying to me, like, hey, like, make sure in the middle of all this, he, he's a musician, uh, yeah. or he, he's many people, he's a musician, so, and he said, like, make sure in doing this, that every single show, every night, at least once a night, take a look out at the crowd and, like, take it all in, take a mental snapshot. You're going to have that with you for the rest of your life. And that was a big thing. I did actually kind of clock in while, while doing that. I re really took that to heart and tried to, to do that. I remember specifically, it was a show in London, Ontario. I took out my like, in-ear monitors on stage with her at the end, like when people were cheering yeah. and just like listened. Um, and as much as that's not maybe like, the thing I learned so much, it was just like learning to like appreciate those kind of moments. Yeah. It's all that stuff. Life goes by fast, man. All kinds of stuff Taking happens. Taking it like, in. Yeah, like so, so to me, that was one of the big things, is just like try and appreciate the really awesome stuff that's happening, even if you have 10 things in front of you that you have to do, and yeah. you're stressed out about whatever, like, take those moments in, it's worth a lot. Cool. And then what's coming up next with the album and, and your tour? And yeah. Um, so we'll be, we'll be touring around the summer. Um, I gotta be back in the studio, like, immediately to finish this record. Um, I've got basically, it's all written. We wrote just over 60 songs that we sit together. Yeah. 36 demos, it was a lot. Um, Yes, yeah, so there's a couple more tracks I need to cut the final versions of, and then that should be up in fall. Sweet. All right, can we have uh, one more song before you go? I certainly can. All right. All right, so the way you let me down. Ready? Two, three.
Thank you.